What's good, what's good, what's good, my sizers? We're back again with another video, and today we'll be talking about 16 different activities you could do with your family for one flat rate. Now, what am I talking about? Well, it's called the Pogo Pass. For those who don't know, the Pogo Pass is this thing you can buy for one price, and you can do 16 different activities. So that's what we'll be talking about today. Speaking of Pogo Pass, this video is sponsored by them, so I just wanna give a quick thanks to them for sponsoring this video. And for you guys, there's a special treat. So if you use my code, which is FUNSIZER, then you can get 50% off. Here is everything that Pogo Pass has to offer. They have updated itself since the last time I've done a video about them. So for example, one of their newer attractions is going to VIP Family, which is basically a big family-friendly indoor playground. And their newest attraction that I just absolutely love is the fact that you can go to the observation deck at the Stratosphere which I think is a really cool opportunity. It's open day and night, so you guys can go whenever, and I just love this, and I can't wait to go back. The first attraction we will be talking about is Pogo Pass's latest addition, and it is Velocity, that is located inside of Town Square, which is only five miles off the strip. Velocity is open 11 a.m. to 10 p.m., Sundays through Thursdays, and on Fridays and Saturdays, they are open from 11 a.m. to midnight. Velocity is welcoming for all ages, especially the 21 and over crowd, because they have lounges and bars. But let's get back to the fun stuff. Not only do they have arcade games, but they also have a bowling alley and an esports section where you can play video games like Minecraft and things like that. And their bowling alley also has a bar in it for those who are 21 and up. And just like any modern day arcade, you can turn in your e-card at the end of the day to get some prizes. And they have prizes ranging of all points and all different sizes. And it's really just a great experience for everyone. And the next attraction is the one and only Sequest, which is an interactive aquarium. And you get one visit while using the Pogo Pass. And Sequest is 2.9 miles away from the strip. So what's really cool about this is that you can interact with them by feeding and petting them. Sequest also offers more interactive opportunities, but that comes with an upgraded VIP pass. Up next, we have Bouncy World, which is an indoor bounce playland. Not only does this place have a bunch of bounce houses, but they are also in the midst of adding their own climbing wall and they're adding slides. But the fun doesn't stop there because they also have a food court and a small area for an arcade. And don't forget when buying a Pogo Pass to use my code FUNSIZER to get 50% off of your order. All right, this one is definitely geared more towards the baseball fans because you are able to attend two aviator games with the Pogo Pass, but don't worry because do not forget with the Pogo Pass, you have 12 months to use it. Here we are at Battle Blast Laser Tag, and to be a Laser Tag spot, I was very impressed. Their lobby is set up like an arcade, so you can play some games while you wait for the next game to load on. And with the Pogo Pass, you get one visit, and it is seven and a half miles away from the strip. Now, this place was really cool because they have a viewing deck, and you can watch them pick out their gear and their teams and put on the vest. But not only that, you can actually watch them go around and play in the arena itself and like go find the hiding spots and everything. They also offer a snack bar area and they have a prize area where you can pick out prizes for when you play the arcade games. But what's really crazy is while I was here filming, this little kid won the jackpot to one of the games and just randomly came up to me and was like, oh my God, I won and hugged me. And I did not know this child, but I was so happy for him. <laughs> Next on the list is Discovery Children's Museum. You get one visit and basically it's a hands-on museum for kids. It offers things such as Young at Art, Discovery Labs, Summit, Fantasy Festival, Eco City, Patents Pending, Toddler Town, Waterworld, and Solve It. And these are just some of what they have to offer. And you can find this museum downtown. Our next pit stop is at Mini Grand Prix. And here you get two visits. Each visit is good for one ride ticket and 20 game tokens, or Pogo Pass members can upgrade to an hour wristband for $13, which is normally $27. Mini Grand Prix has a lot to offer as they have a food court, an arcade, and four racetracks. That includes a kitty cart, the sprint cart speedway, goat carts, and Euro high speed carts. And if you couldn't tell by that, the Euro high speed carts is the fastest track that goes up to 47 miles per hour. That's wild. The attraction we'll be talking about is family fun for anyone. And don't worry, because it even makes the perfect date night and it's bowling. 
so you can go bowling at Gold Coast, the Orleans, Sun Coast, and Sam's Town, and you get one game per month. And let's say you don't go bowling that often, don't worry, because you have a whole year to use your Pogo Pass. For this next attraction, I'm definitely calling all of my adventurous, outdoorsy people for this, because this is rock climbing, but it's not just any rock climbing, it's indoor rock climbing. The Pogo Pass includes three visits to this rock climbing center, and if you've never been rock climbing, or you're still not sure, don't worry, because they walk you through it all. They walk you through how to put on the harness, how to be safe, how to climb, how to be the person that like controls the rope, how to be the person on the wall, how to come down. They go over everything with you. Safety is a really big thing for them. And it's all mats when you're walking on the rock climbing area. It's all mats, it's all padded, and they rent out special shoes for you to wear too. And for all you pet lovers out there, I will say if you like dogs, then definitely come to this spot because the owner does have his two dogs with him. They're very friendly. They usually don't bother the customers and they usually stay behind the counter. However, if their owner is like helping somebody, they will walk around on the form. So that also goes for those who has allergies like myself. Definitely take an allergy pill before coming here. And also it is indoor rock climbing, but they do have big fans on at all times. So you guys will not overheat. And they also provide lockers for you to put your stuff in if you don't want to just leave it in your car and they have more to offer than just rock climbing. They also have this little exercise area right here in the corner. This next spot is definitely for my indecisive people out there and don't worry, I'm right there with you guys. This is called the Rex Center. It's located in the Boulevard Mall and they have anything and everything you could possibly think of. They have ax throwing, beer pong, mini golf, goat carts, rock climbing, laser tag, this spot is definitely the spot to be, especially if you are with a big group who can't really decide on what to do because this spot has a little bit of everything. And they even have food there, so why not? When using the Pogo Pass, you can get up to two visits to this Rex Center. They do go for all ages. And just another reminder, if you do use my code, you can get half off. Again, the code is FUNSIZER. All right, so let's say at this point you're sold on the Pogo Pass, but you're like, man, it's really hot. I'm not trying to be out in the heat. Well, Pogo Pass has you. Cowabunga Bay is a water park that is 23 acres and you can get one visit with the Pogo Pass and they also have 25 water slides, a wave pool, an endless river, kids play area, a splash pool, and for those adults out there who like to drink or just want to have a nice time as well, they also have areas for adults where you can sit and watch your kids go down water slides and drink some alcohol. And if you guys are anything like my family, if you're going to a water park, you're making it last all day. Well, don't worry because Cowabunga Bay has you covered. They serve a lot of food. They have a little food area and then they also have food booths in between the water slides and each of the different areas offered at Cowabunga Bay. This was my first time coming to Cowabunga Bay, but my favorite part about this was their dive-in pool. You can dive into the wave pool and they will put on a movie for you, so I thought that experience alone was really cool. But if you are new to water parks or Vegas heat in general, please wear a lot of sunscreen and invest in some good water shoes because the ground is hot and if you don't believe me, Try doing it barefoot because honey is scorching. All right, this next location is definitely for the kids that wanna be superheroes because this place is crazy. They have trampolines, obstacle courses. They have the climbing walls, super slides, a ninja course, mega play structures, a mini zip line, spider towers and a ball blast area and don't worry for you guys who have toddlers out there they also have a designated toddler section where you can watch your kids at all times as well all right you guys that concludes our video for today so thanks so much for watching if you liked it be sure to give it a big thumbs up comment down below if you guys have heard of the pogo pass if you've used it what your experiences were and don't forget to use my code because it will help you guys in the long run and thank you again for pogo pass for sponsoring this video and be sure to smash that subscribe button down the right at it toodles